What's up, y'all? J.R. Raymond back again, and today I'm going to bring you the new Pure Fantasy by Swag. We're going to check it out. We're going to take it out on a 42-foot lead condition, and we're going to see what it's got. Uh, it's got a typical 42 or 45 by 4.5 by 45 layout on it. Stronger ball, very uh, early, very smooth from what I've seen. Uh, I'm going to take it out here. Let's see how much stronger it gets as we go left, and we're going to see what it's got here in a minute, so stay tuned. They say bowling is a dying sport. A dying sport. <laughs> I disagree. I disagree. I disagree. I disagree. I disagree. BowlerX.com for the love of bowling. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages, here we are with the Pure Fantasy by Swag. Woo! All right, weird intro, but that's all right. We're gonna start, just like always, and try to play straighter. This ball was strong when I practiced with it the other day, so this one might not get through that 10, 11, 12 range. Oh, it did. It still hooked early, but it got there. It hooked early. I think it kind of used up a little bit of energy. And then... Then picked up a little bit more, maybe. I don't know. I'm just guessing. I'm just saying a lot of words for no reason. Ah, moving five left. Wow, I'm actually surprised on how much it's getting through there. That pair over there must have been really beat up when I was bowling on it. Cause these bowling balls were hooking a lot down there. <coughs> Compared to this right now, these are floating through there pretty good now. Or maybe just the few games I put on them helped. Who knows? Five more left. Wow, three for three. Keep moving left, it keeps continuing. So I don't think this is gonna be a ball for big late game transition, of course, but I think fresher conditions, this will be really, really good. Five more left, we're getting through here quick. Now I'll start to get around it a little bit. Ooh, there's that giant hook that I was seeing down there. Maybe got a little grabby with that one, but she picked up and she picked up hard. Oh, I'm gonna go five more left. Almost up against the ball return now. Ah, that one delayed. That one read a little too early and then delayed in the back part of the lane, so it wrapped the 10 pin. Six pin right around it. I'm gonna test myself, I like doing this. Shoot spare straight up the lane, it's fun. Oh no! Oh. Oh. That ain't good. All right, I guess I'll have to leave another 10 pin and try again then. A little too much backup on that one, I guess. Oops. All right, up against the ball return. Now that I'm done messing around. That one picked up better. I think I tilted that one a little bit more. And my axe is facing the ceiling just a little bit higher, a little bit more on that one. Now let's get in front of the ball return. Let's 
looks pretty good. That looks pretty good. That's a little better than the other swag ball in here. This one's picking up a little bit sooner, so it's doing a better job in front of the ball return. <coughs> Try it again. One more time inside here. Oh, flat 10. Oh, I can redeem myself. I can redeem myself. If I'm 0 for 2, man. Pressure's on here. Whew, nervous, nervous. Gotta go up the lane. Can't shoot it normal. Gotta go up the lane. That's what we're supposed to do. All right, that'll end the video. No, I don't feel stupid. All right, there you go. There's the Pure Fantasy by Swag. I'm gonna leave a link in the description. You can get yours today. You can see that ball. Uh, it wasn't as early as I thought it was gonna be. I mean, it actually got cleared through the front pretty good further right. Uh, it did seem a little too early getting going further left. They don't quite want to get through the pins a little bit further left, but still, a lot like a lot of the other fantasies, very good playing further right. Struggled a little bit playing further left. So if you're a lower rev rate or somebody who loves to play straighter, this is going to be the ball for you. So make sure to get yours. It's going to be in the link in the description. Uh, otherwise, come on up to Bowler X Pro Shop and Training Center in Waterford Lanes, and I'll get you taken care of. But that's all I got for you today. I'm going to um, I'll make some more coffee. I'm getting low on cups, though, so... I'm going to have to wash some, but I'm going to go have some coffee, make some lunch, and until next time, we'll see you guys later.